Ginger Roberto has lived in Ludlow for 14 years. She knows every spring there are going to be strong storms with heavy rains. And there's always been runoff from that hill. Um, but it always had trees before and vegetation and all that. And it has backed up under the train trestle where the drain is. But she says Tuesday was different. She took this video of the runoff from the Fisher Home City View development across the street. This time it backed up a good 50, 60 feet further up the road. like, And um, it's never actually been in front of my property before. Roberto says the difference was the mud and debris rushing off the hillside. It wasn't the water. Um, we've seen it before come down, of course, every year. Um, but absolutely, that debris backed everything up. And it was um, just... I've never seen it come down so fast and back up so far here before. She says it took city workers two hours to clear the drain. They had a bobcat out here and the fire department was hosing down the road trying to get all the debris out and it's still kind of a mess under the trestle. Meanwhile, further up Highland Avenue, Council Member Abigail Miller says she had runoff issues in her family's home as well. She took these pictures with her drone. It was a giant mud puddle <laughs> um, and not just rainwater, clear rainwater, but actually muddy water that clearly had just run off the, the mountain behind behind my house. Miller says she wants to see Fisher Homes put up more protective measures to control the runoff until the development has grass and trees to help control the water. She's quick to point out, though, that the developer has offered to provide remediation to anyone adversely affected by the water. If any homeowners have experienced any issues, please have them contact the city, and then the city will give them the information, the Fisher contact information, and hopefully they'll reach out and, and get some remediation done. Now, I reached out to the spokesman for Fisher Homes to request an interview to find out what, if anything, the company would be willing to do to prevent this or at least minimize it in the future, but he declined to speak with us on camera. Now, he did send me a statement which says in part, quote, the construction site has been inspected and there's no evidence of slope failure. Fisher Homes is taking steps to add to the compliant control measures that are already in place. Fisher Homes will continue to monitor and inspect the site pursuant to local stormwater regulations. Now, we will continue to follow this and report back the next time a major storm comes through. In Ludlow, I'm Christian Hauser. From breaking news to feel-good stories, Local 12 has it all. Tap subscribe and hit the links to find out more.